if you run a B2B service business and you're having a hard time selling at higher rates, then this video will show you why you're struggling and how to change it. You aren't in the business that you think you are. If you're an accountant, you're not in the accounting business. If you're a professional portrait photographer, then you're not in the photography business. If you're a voiceover artist, you're not in the voiceover business. This can be a difficult concept to wrap your head around, so I'm going to use an example. I run a video production company that makes animated explainer videos like the one you're watching now. There are hundreds of other studios that make the exact same type of videos at the exact same level of quality for all intents and purposes. In the eyes of a client, the only real difference between us is price. Now, if I try to compete on price, I'm actually accomplishing the opposite of what I want. If I don't compete on price, then they'll go buy from someone else. So how do I solve this problem? The answer is that I stop acting like I'm in the video business and I start acting like I'm in the problem solving business. Let me ask you which is worth more to a client, a two minute explainer video or a video that saves them thousands of hours of labor time a year. See, what we have to realize is that the service we're providing has no intrinsic value to a client unless it's connected with a real business objective. And we don't need to get depressed. The flip side here is that there is no price ceiling for our service as long as we are giving the client more value than we are taking. So by discovering a real problem in our client's business and then offering to solve it for them, we're no longer competing with other services in our industry because we're offering something that's completely custom. Now, the hard part about this approach is that we have to get our minds off of ourselves and our own need to sell. We need to devote our energy into understanding that potential client deeply, understanding what they're losing sleep over, and designing a solution that actually solves a problem. This means that we're going to have to turn some people down because we can't bring them enough value to justify the cost, or maybe because they're stuck in that commodity mindset and they're doing the price comparison thing. But if we can propose a solution in a way that they feel confident that we've really solved a problem, a smart business owner will not hesitate to write a big check and they'll be happy about it. The price that you can command is relative to the value that you can provide to your client. It's not relative to your own costs, which means that every single job is going to have a different price point. When you realize that you can charge two different clients completely different prices for the same service because the value is different for each client, it's going to totally change your business. Now, if you'd like to discuss this concept more, comment below or email me at info at chancegodwin.com.